Hi, welcome back to Raising Readers, our online story time from the Alpha Park Public Library. I'm Miss Sarah, and today our story time is about the letter R, which is for rainbows. And we're gonna get started by moving our body. We've got our friend Bear here with us, and we are going to move our eyes. Can you blink your eyes? We are going to move our legs so you can stomp, you can jump, you can just wiggle around. Uh, and then we're gonna move our fingers. All right, let's get started. Wake up eyes, wake up eyes, wake up eyes and wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wake up eyes, wake up eyes, wake up and wiggle in the morning. Wake up legs, wake up legs, <clears throat> wake up legs and wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wake up legs, wake up legs, wake up and wiggle in the morning. Wake up fingers, wake up fingers, wake up fingers and wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wake up fingers, wake up fingers, wake up and wiggle in the morning. Oh, good job. All right, let's keep moving. This morning and waking our bodies up with a little rocking. You don't have to sit down and snuggle. You can stand up if you want. You can choose how you want to move. Oh, friends who read together, together, together. Oh, friends who read together will stay friends for sure. Let's read a book together, together, together. Let's read a book together and always be friends. All right, thank you, Bear, for helping us today. So our story hour today is about rainbows. And so we have a couple of really fun rainbow stories to read together today. Um, the first one is called, What Makes a Rainbow? I'm going to bring our camera in just a little bit. This is a magic ribbon book, which means that there are ribbons that go through all the pages, and they are going to show us the colors of a rainbow. Let's make sure we can get all of it in here. There we go. Little Rabbit and his mother were sitting under a big flower petal. Look, said Little Rabbit, it stopped raining. Yes said Mama Rabbit. Soon we'll see a rainbow. What makes a rainbow? asked Little Rabbit. Why don't you ask your friends? said Mama Rabbit. Ladybug, what makes a rainbow? asked Little Rabbit. Red, said a ladybug gently, closing her red wings. You need red to make a rainbow. Mr. Fox, what makes a rainbow? asked Little Rabbit. Orange, said Mr. Fox, swishing his orange tail. You need orange to make a rainbow. Little Chick, what makes a rainbow? asked Little Rabbit. Yellow, said Little Chick, fluffing her soft yellow fuzz. You need yellow to make a rainbow. Mr. Grasshopper, what makes a rainbow? asked Little Rabbit. Green, said Mr. Grasshopper, rubbing his long green legs together. You need green to make a rainbow. Bluebird and Beetle, what makes a rainbow? asked Little Rabbit. Blue, says Bluebird, ruffling her pretty blue feathers. And Indigo, said Beetle, showing her shiny indigo back. You need blue and indigo to make a rainbow. So we've got a pretty blue and a very dark blue, that's indigo. Butterfly, what makes a rainbow? asked Little Rabbit. Purple, said Butterfly, spreading her delicate purple wings. You need purple to make a rainbow. There's our rainbow with all of the colors we talked about. Well, said Mama Rabbit to Little Rabbit, now you know what makes a rainbow. Rain, colors, 
red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, purple, and sunshine. The end. Yup, so you need rain and sunshine to make a rainbow, and then you get all of those colors. All right, let's sing a song about rain. That's important for a rainbow. And the song is called Rain is Falling Down. And you're going to need to help me with all the rain sounds. So when the rain is falling down, we're gonna use our fingers as raindrops, wiggle, 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 and bring the rain down. When it hits the ground, it's gonna splash, and we're gonna clap. Then it's gonna pitter-patter. The sound of lots of raindrops makes a pitter-patter sound. And we can make that sound by tapping on our legs. Pitter patter, pitter patter, pitter, back and forth. All right, here we go. The rain is falling down, splash. The rain is falling down, splash. Pitter patter, pitter patter. The rain is falling down, splash. Can we do that again? The rain is falling down, splash. The rain is falling down, splash. Pitter patter, pitter patter. The rain is falling down, splash. One more time. The rain is falling down, splash. The rain is falling down, splash. Pitter patter, pitter patter. The rain is falling down, splash. Good job. All right, let's sing our ABC song together. We're up to the letter R, and R is a fun one to make with your fingers. It's, um, it gets a little tricky until you get some strength in your fingers, but we just need to cross them. So if you need help, just twist them. So we're twisting our first two fingers, holding the other ones down. R. So start off like you're making a two and cross them. R. All right, let's sing our ABCs together. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me? Oh, great job. Let's read another story. Then we have a couple more songs today. The next story we have is called My Color is Rainbow. We have lots of the rainbow colors on the cover. This is by Agnes Sue, H-S-U. Let's find out why their color is rainbow. Oh. We don't start off with a rainbow color, do we? What color is that? It's gray. Little White Arch looked white, but he knew he was more than the color white. He wondered, could I become another color? There's the face. Little White Arch dreamed of the possibilities. Hmm, what color would he like to be? We're red. Won't you fall in love with us? Little White Arch loved the idea of being loving. He could become red. Is red your favorite? Let's see. We're friendly and orange. Come play with us. Little White Arch was delighted to play with his new friends. He could become orange. We're yellow and skippity hoppity happy to see you. Little White Arch couldn't help but do a little dance. He could become yellow. We're green. Let's dig our hands in the dirt. Little White Arch cared about nature and helping the earth. He could become green. We're blue and calm as still as the ocean. Won't you take a snooze with us? Hmm. Little White Arch realized he needed a peaceful moment from his adventures. He could become blue. We're purple and we're here to celebrate our majestic color. Won't you join our party? Little White Arch felt special living it up. He could become purple. Hmm. Do you have any favorites? What color should he try? Let's see. Little White Arch pondered what color to be. Hmm. He's thinking about it. 
he could become red and loving, orange and friendly, yellow and happy, green and helpful, blue and peaceful, purple and majestic. Or he could become all the colors. I found my color. My color is rainbow. Ooh, look at all that fun. The end. That is my color is a rainbow. All right, so we sang about the rain, and now we need to sing about the sun because those are the two important ingredients in a rainbow, rain and sun. So we're gonna sing Raffi's Mr. Sun song. We'll sing it through two times. I hope you like it. Oh, Mr. Sun, sun, Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on me. Oh, Mr. Sun, sun, Mr. Golden Sun, shine, hiding behind a tree. These little children are asking you to please come out so we can play with you. Mr. Sun, sun, Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on me. That's a fun song to sing on a rainy day. Um, there are lots of fun rainy day songs. Rain, rain, go away, those kinds of songs. And this is a sun one. All right, let's try it together again. If you know it, I want to hear you sing with me. Oh, Mr. Sun, sun, Mr. Golden Sun, Please shine down on me. Oh, Mr. Sun, sun, Mr. Golden Sun, hiding behind a tree. These little children are asking you to please come out so we can play with you. Oh, Mr. Sun, sun, Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on me. All right, and there's one more fun song that we haven't sang in quite a few weeks that I think you know, and it's about a little itsy bitsy spider. All right, the rain comes down, the sun comes out, maybe there's a rainbow in the itsy bitsy spider's experience. Let's try it out. So get your fingers ready. I go like this, but there are lots of ways you can make a spider, okay? The itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sunshine and dried up all the rain, and the itsy bitsy spider went up the spout again. One more time. All right. The itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sunshine and dried up all the rain, and the itsy bitsy spider went up the spout again. Ah, good job. All right, let's look at our craft and our song sheet for today. Today's song sheet R is for rainbow, rocket, rectangle, rabbit, and robot. And the craft in your craft kit today is your very own rainbow. You're going to get half of a paper plate and some cotton. First, I want you to take your rainbow strips and glue or tape them on, hanging down from your cloud. And then add your cotton to make your cloud light nice and fluffy. If you have older kids, you might wanna talk about the order of the colors of the rainbow. It's just a fun fact to memorize. And I hope you have a nice, fun, cheerful craft to put up in your house or give away. Let's finish off with, if you're happy and you know it, we are gonna stomp our feet, get up and move in, and shout hooray, okay? If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray! If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray! If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray! All right, friends, next week, the letter S. I will see you soon. Take care.